We're at Lord's Cricket Ground for the British Sports Book of the Year Awards. It is a star-studded event. We'll be crowning the winners of the very best sports books. Cycling, swimming, football, it's a, it's a real mixed bag. I'm excited about being here and uh, being part of it. I'm giving an award to my huge friend Hugh McElvey. The Crossbook Award is such a, a prestigious award and to be nominated is a, a great achievement in itself. Yeah, it was a very, very strong field and a very difficult decision to try and find a winner. People kept talking about finding your style. I had no idea what, what the hell that was. All those autobiographies were brilliant, you know, it's, it's a job to, to decide what is better than another, really, to be honest, all, they all tell their own story and they're all very good. Um, I could really identify um, with some of the books and, and some of the, the individual stories. But I wanted to get it, you know, spot on and, and a book that I'm really proud of and I'm very pleased to be able to say that we've done that. Some fantastic books up there and I'm um, looking forward to seeing, you know, all, all the fantastic people who, who, who've taken the time to write those, put them together. You know, the inspirational speech here or somebody said something there and that, 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 that inspirational word that, that takes somebody over the line that's what I'm kind of looking forward to uh, hearing about tonight and if I can uh, pick up a book to read on holiday then, then uh, all, all the better. No it's just entertaining to come along and see a few of the other sports and various other things going on. And there's a great array of talent there and I just feel very honoured to be in amongst them and hopefully with a chance. I wanted just to tell all the fans, the true story of Marco Negri. I was once here actually as a possible winner of the, the Autobiography of the Year. Well, 25 years ago I arrived to England not speaking any English and now I've been nominated to two awards, so that's very cool. Tim Moore, you were robbed, um, luckily by me. I'm not, um, I'm not somebody who found this easy. I'd like to think of myself as a as a man of few words and after a year and a half of writing I realised that was a, a major impediment to writing a book. Um, I'd like to emphasise to Alec Butler, the Sunday Times sports editor who's out there at my table, that I'll be looking to go on earning a crust or two from infiltrating his pages now and then. I, I didn't expect this, you know, very, very rarely you get me uh, struggling for words. As I look up out amongst you uh, this evening, I get that overwhelming feeling of, I wonder what price I would have got in the bookies for winning this uh, <laughs> award. Joe's speciality is um, proving himself against the odds. And uh, I don't bet, if I did, I wouldn't bet against him playing in the Premier League again. relax and enjoy, it should be some night. Nice.